Hello students. I hope your preparation for the competitive examinations is well on track. Today I will discuss certain type of questions that you can solve by using certain mathematical concepts. If you do not know these concepts, you will not be able to solve such questions under time pressure. So let us have a look on one such question. The question is asking about the maximum value of the given expression. What do you think is the right method to solve this question? The students generally try this question by using options or by taking different values of a and b. So let us find what will happen if we take different values of a and b. I have taken here two different sets of a and b. In the first set, I have taken a to be equal to 10 and b equal to 5. And when I put these values in the given expression, the value of the expression comes out to be 1100. If we take another set that is a equal to 5 and b equal to 12, then the value of the expression is 540. So for different values of a and b, you are getting different values of the expression. So do you think that this is the right way to solve this question? I hope this is not the right way. So how will you approach these questions? Actually, these questions are based on the concept that for any numbers, the arithmetic mean of the numbers is always greater than or equal to their geometric mean. So we will try to solve this question by using this concept. Now, let us try to solve this question. Here I will use that the arithmetic mean of the numbers is always greater than or equal to their geometric mean. So I will take three numbers, 3a, 4b, and 72 minus 3a minus 4b. And their arithmetic mean will be equal to sum of these numbers divided by 3 and their geometric mean is equal to cube root of their product. Now, after simplification the left hand side, what we are left with is 24 greater than or equal to 12 raised to power 1 by 3 into AB into 72 minus 3A minus 4B. If I cube on both sides, the resultant expression will be AB into 72 minus 3A minus 4B less than or equal to 24 cube divided by 12. And this is equal to 1152. That means the maximum value that this expression can take is 1152. And since we have solved this question by a proper method, there is no doubt about this value. That means the answer to the given question is the option 3 that is 1152. So this was the actual approach to solve such questions. I have discussed these questions and some more questions in my full length video which you can access on hitbullseye.com. Best of luck for your preparations for the examinations. Thank you very much.